Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 15 in chapter 11. Chapter 11 is about angular momentum. And in this system, we can see at initial we have the one non-rotating cylinder disk. For this object, the moment of inertia is given, and the angular velocity is zero because it's non-rotating, right? And then it dropped onto identical disk. So this one tells us the momentum of inertia i is given, and then the uh, initial disk for the ang angular speed omega naught is given, and it tells us no external torque. No external torque. That means the angular momentum is conserved, right? We need to find the final angular speed. So in this one, we can see the angular momentum is conserved initial angular momentum equal to final angular momentum. Initially, we just have one disk, so I times omega naught. And so finally, we have these two disks attached together, so we have two I, right? I plus I, two I times final angular speed. In this one, we can get the final answer. Thank you.